Good afternoon, this is your Doctor of Liberty, John Hilston, coming at you from another very historic spot. Over my shoulder is the Battle of San Jacinto Monument. Uh, I'm right near Houston, Texas. Uh, this is the battleground uh, where the Texans uh, won their independence uh, from Mexico. Uh, they had been having not such a great time uh, in the previous month. So this happened April 21, 1836. Uh, in March, of course, the famous Alamo fell. Uh, and then there was a slaughter of Texas troops at Goliad, Texas, which is south of here. Anyways, uh, so the Texans had retreated uh, back to here, and the town was called Harrisburg at that point. Uh, and General Sam Houston was the commander of the forces. Uh, anyway, that's why, of course, the city is now known as Houston, among other reasons. But uh, anyway, um, so the Mexicans were feeling pretty confident. In fact, their president, Santa Ana, was leading them in battle, which is not probably the smartest thing. Uh, so anyway, they gave up the high ground, which is never something you should do in a battle, and they backed themselves up to a salt marsh, and uh, the intelligence apparently was good enough uh, for General Houston that he decided to press the attack. The total battle lasted uh, around 20 minutes. Um, you know, there was some level of slaughter after that. Uh, there were a total of nine Texas casualties. And by the way, when we say Texas, uh, first of all, uh, the main big guns that they had, two of them were uh, donated by the citizens of Cincinnati, Ohio. And there were many Americans from other places. So this was quite a bit an American fight, if not in name. Uh, so, but anyways, a total of nine Texans died in the battle, where by contrast, 600 Mexicans died in the same battle. Um, so this was a slaughter, and, and it was really due to Santa Ana's arrogance. And so I'm going to spin around here, and of course it's the Houston ship channel that's there, so you can see a barge passing by. Um, but behind me, oh, I don't know, a little over 100 yards, was a tree. So Sam Houston was wounded in this battle. Um, you know, he hurt his ankle pretty badly. Uh, had a couple horses shot out from under him. Uh, anyway, he was resting under a tree and his troops brought him Santa Ana as a prisoner of war. And so he was able to extract, uh, because of Santa Ana's fear of imprisonment and or death, uh, significant terms, basically Mexican army turning around and all of the Mexican armies retreating um, anyway and a surrender and so on. So he got a whole lot. He basically got that independence in part because Santa Ana was arrogant, had his troops resting, and in part because not a good idea to have your president, who is kind of a dictator, leading the army. Anyway, uh, carrying on too long here, this is your Doctor of Liberty, another Liberty place where Texas gained their independence. I'm out.